You washed your hands, right? Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of tacos. That smells good. Yeah, that looks good. Easy peasy. That's delicious. Mm -hmm. Hello there, I am here today with my friend Gabby and Gabby runs the local farmer markets here in Vancouver and so she's very knowledgeable about food and she's also a really great cook. I've been to her place for dinner and we've had some really amazing dishes. I hope you come and make some pizza here because I want to show the pizza recipe to you guys. Um, but what are we making today, Gabby? We're making uh, jackfruit tacos with homemade tortillas. Mm, I'm excited. It's going to be delicious. Okay, what are we going to start off with here, Gabby? We're going to start off with tortillas. So we're going to do a blend of flour and corn tortillas. So we are doing one cup of this. Yeah, the masa corn flour. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> okay, next um, you can get some water. Let's just measure out. Um, it's about three half cups, so three quarter, three quarter cups, right? <laughs> no. How many cups are we trying to do? <laughs> We're doing uh, three quarter cups. So uh, this is what again? This, this is, is half, half a cup. So, okay, yeah. I'm going to pour half of this out and then that's three quarter cup. Because okay. I just did half and then cool. one, half of one of these. Cool. Yeah? Got okay. Um, and then we need some salt and oil. How much salt? Just a pinch of salt. Oh. Salt bay. <laughs> um, and then just, I never measure out the oil. I just kind of pour it in. There you go. So you just want to mix it until it kind of forms like a ball. I'm going to put in another um, like couple tablespoons here and just see how that goes. You washed your hands, right? Yes, I did. <laughs> So you don't want it to be um, too sticky because then it will just stick to the pan and not come out. Uh, um, you still want it to be like a little bit dry. So just keep adding water until it kind of forms a ball. Okay. So we're at about one to one to one. Yeah, almost. I've never made tacos from scratch before. It's so easy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, it formed like a loose ball here. Leave it in the same bowl and then put it aside and then we'll come back to it in about half an hour. So while we're waiting for the, uh, the tortillas to rest, we're going to work on our jackfruit filling. Um, so we'll start off with just dicing or slicing this onion. Slicing? Okay. Yeah. Longways? Yeah. So about three or four cloves, but I got big ones, so yeah, these are, are fine. Yeah, they're huge, so you can definitely <laughs> yeah. just get away with just doing it. This might be elephant garlic. <laughs> <laughs> you want a minced or? Yeah, mince please. And then we're also going to do a quick pickled onion just for the top. So you may as well, while we're cutting onions, nice. just slice that. Bring on the tears. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. That's enough. So we'll just, just to make the quick pickled onion, it's really simple. Just toss them in a bowl. And then I'm using rice wine vinegar. This is already seasoned, so it has like a bit of sugar in it. Um, and it's super simple. You just pour it on. I love rice vinegar. I know, it has such good flavor. So we use about half a cup there? Yeah, just half a cup. As long as um, like it's kind of covering like a nice base of the of the bowl so that the onions can kind of soak up that vinegar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that looks good. We'll set that aside. That's all you do. That's all you do. Oh, perfect. <laughs> I know, it's so easy. Make sure to get the jackfruit in brine and not in syrup because it also oh. comes in syrup. Yeah. Um, so yeah, don't make that mistake. Just pour out that juice. And what about the seeds? I've sort of heard some people, or is that the seed or no? Uh, it's not really a seed. Okay. It's just like a part of the flesh. Like you can see it here okay. where it just is like a little knobby thing, but mm -hmm. it's totally fine. Just use all of yeah, it. Yeah, just use all of it. I even use like the middle bit and I just kind of tear it. Mm -hmm. And we'll kind of like mash it up in the pan too. So oh, okay. yeah, it doesn't need to be too precise. Next, we'll just fry everything up. I don't know uh, how... Medium high? Yes. <laughs> awesome. Get some oil in there. And then we'll start off with our onion. Oh. And then, um, do you want to get some salt and sprinkle some salt over? Yeah. 
So yeah, you kind of want to just fry up those onions until they get uh, like some color on them. You don't want to caramelize them, but definitely get them like a little bit brown. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. Anything that we can do in between? Uh, no. <laughs> I think we're good. We could just sip on our wine. Yes. Uh, we didn't have a rolling pin, and so we are drinking a bottle of wine so that we can have a rolling pin. That's the only reason why we're drinking this yeah, wine. Only reason. It was, yeah. Not for like my courage. No. <laughs> <laughs> but you're a, like a, one of those bartenders that throws things around, right? Okay, so well, let's see. Try. I'm so nervous. So oh. just pushing forward, and then when it gets there, you're pulling it back. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that was okay. <laughs> nice. Whoa! Look at you go. <laughs> I didn't lose an onion. <laughs> yeah. Yay! <laughs> so the onions are looking about ready to go. Um, so we can toss in the garlic next, and then we'll just fry that up for another minute or so until the garlic gets nice and fragrant, and then we'll toss in some spices. So um, it's about time for us to put our spices in. So this is chili powder, basically just like cayenne. We won't put, how spicy is this? It's, it's pretty spicy. Yeah, okay, we won't put too much in. I like a lot of spice. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sorry. Good. I like a lot of spice. <laughs> <laughs> um, they're gonna be spicy. I hope that's okay, Natasha. Um, <laughs> we'll put in some, some, gar some ground garlic. Um, this is just a bit of paprika. That's a lot of paprika. Oh, <laughs> I like my spices, <laughs> yeah. okay? okay? So we got about a, what, a teaspoon of garlic? Or yeah, about a teaspoon. I'd say like almost... Like a ten tablespoons of paprika? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like a, a tablespoon of paprika. I probably overdid it with the chili, but it's fine. We're going to throw some, um, some barbecue sauce on here, so hopefully that'll kind of like mellow out the spiciness. That smells good. Yeah, that looks good. And then the last step is to use some, your favorite um, barbecue sauce. I'm using Sweet Baby Ray's. That's Have you my, had it before? My favorite, yeah. yeah, it's so good. Really high sugar. It is, yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> but it's perfect for this, because like it's yeah. nice to have, um, like with the heat and everything, adding some sugar. You can just toss in as much as you, you want. <laughs> How many tablespoons would you say that is? I'd say that's about a <laughs> third of a cup. Okay. Um, and then just toss it around. Um, if you want to add more, if you like more like sloppy um, or like sauciness, you can definitely add more. But I think that looks about right. You cook it for about 15 minutes. Really? Yeah, 10 to 15. Um, you want this sauce to like get nice and caramelized. Mm, it smells so good right now and looks really good. Yeah. So while we're cooking that, actually, we can probably work on our dough. We can just like break it down into separate balls, try to get them um, to be the same size. So I usually just like half it and then I'll half it again and then I'll half it again. <laughs> An inch? Yeah, like a, an inch around, maybe an inch and a half around. So yeah, like that. Okay. Yeah. It's a lot of tacos. A lot of tacos. <laughs> yeah. We finished the wine. <laughs> um, so yeah, you want to get these pretty thin, um, just so they're not like too floury and tasting like a pita. <laughs> I'll usually use a plate, like I have a perfectly sized plate at home. I didn't look at your, your plate. What is going on? <laughs> like, where is that even coming from? <laughs> perfect, perfect. Um, yeah, so you can use like a, a small plate or a lid or something that's round, or you can just like freestyle it and cut it around yourself, or you don't need to cut it at all if you don't really care about how your tacos look. But. Today we're going for perfection. So, oh, nice. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, there's there's well, our little taco. Perfect. So cute.
So we're using a cast iron skillet here. Um, so you want to heat this up so it's nice and hot at like medium, medium to low temperature. Is that what that five is? Yeah, four. Um, and you don't actually need to use any oil at all. I've used oil in the past and the, um, just because you're frying so many tacos or so many tortillas that it actually gets way too hot and starts to smoke. Um, so I've had like the best experience just cooking them on a dry pan. Oh. Yeah. Basically, you just would keep checking underneath to see if it gets like nice and white or even like a tiny bit brown. Um, but yeah, they will, you'll see, like this looks like raw dough and then underneath will look um, nice and white. Sometimes also they bubble up, which you do want to see some bubbles. So um, if you get bubbles, that's a, a good sign. So yeah, they're starting to get like a little bit of color mm -hmm. on them, but they still need a little more time. You want to see more browning. So yeah, that's looking pretty good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> okay, let's try the last couple with some oil. I'm just curious. Yeah, it definitely can be done, but I just noticed that they are definitely a little bit oilier, but yeah, yeah they're still good. Okay, now we got our huge stack of tortillas here, nice. <laughs> um, and we can just start plating. Okay. How do you um, do that? Oh, easy, <laughs> easy peasy. Um, so we're doing it on here. We need a spoon. Avocado. Yeah, a bit of avocado. Could make guacamole if you were if you really felt like it, but I just like sli sliced avocado. Yeah, it's easy. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty nice. I am just <laughs> savoring, say, <laughs> salivating over this. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Oh my goodness. What do you think? <laughs> That's delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow, nice job. Yeah. What do you think of the tortilla? It's perfect. Mm, I can't believe we just made that. I think this has changed my mind about jackfruit. You didn't like it before? Well, the store-bought one that I had just wasn't that great. To this, right. Maybe it's the baby rice, but <laughs> yeah, you killed it with this one. It's cool. delicious. Thanks. I mm. actually make this recipe almost like once a week, so. You're yeah. a pro. <laughs> well, we are gonna enjoy some more of these tacos. I'm excited to dig in here. But thank you for watching. As I mentioned, Gabby's gonna have a channel pretty soon, hopefully, right? Mm -hmm. um, so we'll leave a link. Um, even if it happens way later, we'll put a link somewhere. Um, but yeah, if you haven't subscribed, love to have you join us. We got a ton of recipes, um, all plant-based for the past two years. But if you're not plant-based, I got more. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Bye for now.